I'm Isha, co-founder in Hymira. Mira is the manufacturer of uh, secure uh, communication solutions for uh, usage by uh, defense forces and kind of extreme uh, users like first responders, right, uh, police, emergency services, etc., and etc., and etc. We started because of the start of the full-scale invasion. We saw the issues that were experienced by Ukrainian defense and security forces and looked into what what unique expertise we have to solve it. I think the key answer to that is that in the how we develop them, uh, because any, anything we do next day is already tested at the front line. Week later, we receive very honest and kind of very honest, blatant kind of feedback where, you know, at the beginning, most of it was bad and it was slowly beginning better and better. Now, most of it is good. Sometimes there is some interesting feedback where like, we didn't even know you can use them that way. We understand why it doesn't work <laughs> well in that condition. Let us work on this and let us resolve that issue. Rasm is, as, as, as you know, as mentioned, is one of the key partners that we work with, that we discuss kind of the future applications. Rasm also has very good uh, connection and communication with many users that, you know, communication with Rasm will keep us to learn even more on our side and to understand which direction is uh, currently a priority to develop in, because, you know, there are infinite ways how we can develop the product. Understanding which way exactly to go is the key advantage that we have, and we want to and want to keep that uh, key advantage. Uh, at the side, obviously, uh, the budget that Rasm spent on procuring the radius helps us grow, helps us, um, you know, pay the taxes in Ukraine, pay the salaries in Ukraine, uh, keep the uh, manufacturing capacity here, uh, and also uh, by uh, applying more and more and having more and more devices in usage, uh, we, there is uh, it provides a faster way for us to start working with the government. Because obviously, the government has more budgets to spend than any military support fund or any humanitarian support fund or any volunteer fund, whatever you call them, uh, obviously the government has by orders of magnitude more budgets, but they also don't like to do small kind of procurements. They also don't like to, they're not as fast as, not as, as flexible. And so uh, uh, Razum, for example, playing key away on, on our journey from kind of starting to growing to then finally being able to work directly with the government to, and then hopefully Razum can dedicate those budgets to something else, something also growing up after we have a more uh, strategic and uh, um, reliable or uh, work with the government.